you're doing the wrong things to grow your practice. Hi everyone, Angus Pryor here, multi award winning practice growth specialist. Now I am currently on a cruise. That's the South Island of New Zealand and I've had a lot of time to think in recent times about why don't practices grow faster. The truth is I've spent more than 10,000 hours consulting with practices in Australia and internationally and you know one of the big challenges in business is that you've got so many decisions to make don't you? It's like hundreds of decisions. The only problem is many of those decisions are not actually causing your business to grow. There are things, for example, behind me here. We've got some life rafts, we've got a life preserver, etc., etc., and those things are important. But getting those 10% better or 20% better or 50% better, is that going to make this business grow any faster? And the answer, of course, is no. Now, in healthcare, the thing that I see happening quite often is that people focusing on growing their clinical skills. And I don't have a problem with that per se, except that in many cases, it simply doesn't help your business to grow. Why not? There's two reasons. The first is that you are getting better at something that your patients simply don't understand. Does that make sense? Like you're, you've kind of got your ladder up against the wrong wall. It's like, hey, we're better clinically than the practice down the road. Well, but if your patients don't understand that, how is it gonna help you to grow? And the second part is that uh, in many cases, what I see is that healthcare professionals will go and do extra training, but they never implement it, in which case the, the practical impact of them doing that is very low. So the question is, what are the decisions you need to focus on to make your practice grow? And the good news is, before I went on leave, I wrote a course that goes over five weeks uh, where we will send you an email twice a week. It's got a five minute task you've got to do. And at the end of five weeks, you'll have a grade against 10 different categories that in my experience, based on more than 10,000 hours of consulting, is the things that are actually gonna make your practice grow. Now, would you like to get a hold of that course? We'll put a note below, just say me or yes please or something, uh, and I'll be pleased to send that to you because I wanna make you having the right decisions so you can grow at your practice. See you next time.